So as this knockout force makes his way to the octagon, Joe, this is not a guy you want to stand on a napkin in the center of the octagon and trade punches with. You're getting a slugfest with this guy. More often than not, you're concussed, twitching on the canvas. You can be sure he'll be looking to make contact and find a home for those heavy hands early and often. Power for days, power in all of his strikes. Scary, scary addition to this division. And a guy who a lot of people believe will be an immediate contender. This guy is a great striker. What he wants to do is land hard and early, get the respect of his opponent, and avoid any grappling exchanges. So here he is, the two-time Combat Sambo world champion, lightweight contender, Khabib Nurmagomedov. Undefeated for the mixed martial arts career, he has been dominant every step of the way. Joe the Eagle trains out of the famed American Kickboxing Academy in San Jose, California. This next guy has incredible takedowns. Both timing, speed, and of course, technique are literally top of the food chain. for this, our main event of the evening. Well, how about the age discrepancy here? More than 15 years apart, and they both possess a similar height and reach. All right, now, for the official introductions, we send it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Heavyweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Taekwondo fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 8 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting at Los Angeles, California, Joe Rogan! And now for his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding professional record of. 27 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Habib the Eagle All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. And with that touch of the gloves, we are underway. Here we go, first one. You ready? You ready? Let's well, go. no better way to pay homage to the history of pride in the UFC with this single night UFC Grand Prix tournament. Some of the best fighters in the world have come out. Let's see who will be the last fighter standing here tonight. Nurmagomedov gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Try to establish that jab. Oh, he's been working hard defensively. Kick block there. Oh, wow. Slams him right to the canvas, Joe. And now is where things could get really interesting. He's looking to isolate an arm here, looking for the Kimura. He's got his arm pinned down. It looks like the Kimura is locked in and tight for him. Oh, we're getting a finish here. This is getting tighter and tighter. He might have to tap. That's it. And there it is. Great.
Great job, didn't waste any time, took this fight to the ground and got the early submission. Well, yeah, Joe, that was fun while it lasted. He told us he wanted to be at his most efficient here tonight. He certainly didn't waste a lot of time. He knew he wanted to get the fight to the ground. He gets the early takedown, and the submission follows shortly thereafter. And here's the end. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And here we see it again. Beautiful submission victory. So a seminal moment for this fighter here tonight as he gets the win by submission. Huge victory in his career. And it'll be very interesting to see how they match make him moving forward. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer Mario with the official Yamasaki decision. Is stop in this contest at one minute, 28 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by submission due to a Kimura. Habib, the Eagle.